Merry Christmas Eve. The day before Christmas is a very special day. That never had its own name. But that all changed when one special elf rose to glory and fame. Eve was an elf with such get up and go. She worked hard and loved to play. But the head elf ran Christmas with an iron fist. And this was what he had to say. While I'm in charge, play is forbidden. Everyone has one thing to do. Soon I will be number one at the poll. I'm so sick of being number two. So the reindeer may only fly in straight lines. The girl elves must do all the baking. Santa's so busy he left everything to me. And no, I won't tolerate any head shaking. We are delivering presents to two billion kids. We don't have time for fun. No singing, no laughing, no chatting, no nothing. Now get back to work, get it done. Well, that wasn't good enough for our Eve. That wasn't what Christmas was about. It's family and friends, and togetherness and fun. Where's the spirit? Eve wanted to shout. And then she realized, with a gasp, the spirit was nowhere around to stop the head elf and bring joy to the pole. The Christmas spirit had to be found. Eve searched everywhere, but she had no luck, and the North Pole was losing its groove. The reindeer were so bored with flying straight lines. They lay down and said, we won't move. It got worse as she searched around Santa's workshop. The elves' arms were starting to ache. All work and no play turned their smiles upside down. And there were millions of toys to make. And still the head elf kept them under control. This is my pole. Do more. Do more. Then Eve's searching revealed a heavily guarded box that she'd never seen before. Eve walked up to the box, but the guard said, Halt! Who goes there? Stop your walking. What's inside the box? Eve innocently asked. No, the guards yelled. We're not talking. We won't tell you we're guarding the Christmas spirit. We won't. We are forbidden. Eve took her chance and pointed away. Look, she cried, a baby kitten. While the guards ran off giggling, searching for kittens, Eve snuck inside the box, and when she saw the Christmas spirit lying inside, it shocked her to her little elf socks. What happened? she cried. Who did this to you? The spirit let out a sigh. The head elf, it croaked, locked me up. He's afraid of spirits that fly. You see, Eve 
Some people need that control. They think it gives them power. But when our spirits, not able to express who we are, we grow weaker by the hour. Eve stared at the spirit and knew in her heart, all spirits must be set free. The head elf's control made people act his way. They couldn't be the best they could be. We'll show the head elf that he's got it all wrong. Every elf's spirit must shine. Together as one, we can light up the world. Come on, spirit. It's Christmas saving time. The spirit of Christmas tried to rise, but it was worse than Eve had feared. So she picked it up, held it close to her heart, and suddenly, faintly, red and green lights appeared. Eve whooped and she sprinted out of the box. And as she ran round through the snow, she shouted, Elves, be yourselves. Let your spirit shine bright. Come on, come on, let's go. And with every step, Eve's spirit shone through with her belief of how Christmas should be. And the spirit of Christmas transformed the North Pole, setting all of the spirits there free. No! screeched the head elf. No, no, no! You'll ruin Christmas Day! It's me! I must run all of Christmas. I won't let you get in my way. He made lots of nets out of tinsel and lights and hurled them through the air. But the Christmas spirit put wings on Eve's feet. And when every net landed, Eve wasn't there. Ho, ho, no, boomed Santa, stomping through the snow as another tinsel net missed. Head elf. You have your wish. You are now number one. On my naughty list. As the head elf was taken away by the guards, he screamed, You need me. Nothing will get done. Perhaps not, Santa said, winking at Eve. But at least we'll have lots of fun. I was so worried things were getting out of hand. The gift list had become so large. I forgot Christmas is about having fun together. So I put the wrong elf in charge. But one special elf has shown us the way. She's reminded us what to believe. We can work and can play in our own special way. So the new head elf of Christmas is Eve. Eve burst with pride, the Christmas spirit by her side. She truly earned her new fame. And then Santa declared that the day before Christmas now had a very special name. Merry Christmas Eve.